Mr. Wives Family Reunion Cody Brown snubbed Hello guys, I am Sabrina, to you welcome back to my channel. Please subscribe the channel and press bell icon for latest news updates. The Sister Wives family had a reunion, but was Cody Brown snubbed? There are questions as to who was at the Brown family reunion. Cody has been on the road recently. Kristen Brown shared the details of her reunion. She's been enjoying life away from her ex-husband. She found love again and sparked a newfound friendship with Janelle Brown. Who was at this reunion? Sister Wives spoilers, Christine Brown shares reunion photos. Christine Brown has remained close to the children of her fellow sister wives, Mary Brown and Janelle Brown. The ladies have 13 kids in total. They are loved by their moms very much. Christine and Janelle have been spending more time together than they ever did in their relationship. They even started a new business together. Janelle's daughter, Maddie Brown, and Christine's daughter, Michael T. Brown, have also teamed up. Christine had a reunion, but it's not what you think. She reunited with Janelle and Maddie. Christine Brown shared a recap in an Instagram reel. The three ladies smiled at the camera and laughed. Christine admitted this time together was so needed. Sister Wives fans took to the comment section to react to their sweet and tender moment. I just love seeing you guys spending time together, one fan wrote. Beauties, you will always be family, another user noted. Y'all made my day. Here's to many more. Sending big hugs and all the love, wrote a third user. Sister Wives spoilers, Cody Brown's family reunion. Meanwhile, Cody Brown traveled to Wyoming. Some fans think it's for the upcoming Brown family reunion. Over on Reddit, Sister Wives fans shared clues about who will attend the reunion. Some of the family members shared their traveling updates on social media. Fans noticed Maddie and Janelle traveled to Wyoming for the family reunion. Janelle will meet her other kids there. Christine is going on a road trip with Truly and another on her own. She might drop Truly off first before heading back to Wyoming. Janelle mentioned that Christine would be in Wyoming with Truly. Michael T. also hinted about a family reunion shortly after Garrison's passing. They might do something to honor him. In another Instagram video, Janelle shared that she will be seeing Maddie Brown, Caleb Bush, and their kids for the 4th of July. Cody Brown wasn't snubbed after all. He will be reuniting with his kids and sister wives. However, it isn't clear whether Mary Brown will attend. There was also no news of Robin Brown and her family attending. However, Sister Wives, Christine Brown takes a dig at Cody again with her infamous nacho moment. Sister Wives star Christine Brown doesn't leave a chance to grill her ex-husband, Cody Brown. She often uses her wittiness to take a direct shot at his narcissism and toxicity. Fans have seen Cody targeting his wives and making weird comments about them. He has been very fond of his personality and felt that his wives were crazy about his looks. Christine has not been shying away from roasting her ex-husband for his nasty comments. Fortunately, her new husband, David Woolley, also joins her in the banter. He gushes over at his wife to make sure that she feels loved and valued. Fans love to see the couple having fun and mocking Cody Brown in different ways. Recently, the couple took to social media again to take a dig at the polygamist again. Sister Wives Christine Brown grills ex-husband Cody Brown with another nacho moment. Sisters Wives star Kristen Brown faced a lot during her polygamous marriage with Cody Brown. TLC viewers have seen the latter disrespecting his wives and making nasty comments on them over the years. They are well aware of Cody's judgmental thoughts about Kristen eating nachos. He expressed his disgust over his third wife after witnessing her eating nachos. Previously, Kristen took a dig at her former husband by uploading some pictures of herself eating nachos with her husband. Recently, she posted a video with David to take direct aim at her haters. In it, she was sitting in a car with her husband while munching a bowl of nachos for breakfast. The TLC star indirectly reflected on the time when she was judged for eating nachos. Christine said, We're at the gas station where I ate nachos infamously years ago. She went ahead and compared it with her present life while eating them again at 6 a.m. with her partner. The reality TV star was enjoying her time early in the morning with David. Meanwhile, the latter admitted that he also liked eating nachos in her company. Christine wrote, 
He likes the way I eat my nachos in the caption. Fans were impressed with Christine's savageness. One fan said, that had to happen years ago just so that you can have this moment right here a beautiful ending. Meanwhile, others suggested the reality TV celeb should make it an annual tradition. Moreover, a different fan added, I love savage Christine who has zero fix to give. Sister wives, Christine finally reunites with Janelle after months without each other. Sister Wives stars Christine and Janelle always had each other's backs in their best and worst phases. Sadly, the latter went to North Carolina to spend some time with her daughter after Garrison's passing. Christine and her bestie didn't share many details on their latest meetups on social media. Hence, a lot of viewers started speculating about a rift between the former wives. Recently, Christine posted some lovely updates of her latest reunion with her best friend and her daughter Madison. She wrote, we got to spend the day together and it was so needed. Incredibly grateful for family. Moreover, she looked happy after meeting Janelle for a long time. However, Cody and Robin Brown back to Utah after blowing family up. Our Sister Wives stars Cody and Robin Brown going back to Utah after blowing the whole family up. They escaped the state in season two due to strict polygamy laws. Then some wanted to move back, but Cody played mind games when that was concerned. So what has possibly brought the couple back home? Cody and Robin Brown back to Utah after blowing family up. When Sister Wives began in 2010, the plural family resided in a single family home in Lee, Utah. Cody Brown had 12 children under one roof with his three wives, Mer Brown, Janelle Brown, and Christine Brown Woolley. The home was built by a polygamist so each wife had their own space but then Robin Brown came along. She lived five hours away but eventually moved closer once she became a part of the family. Yet in season two, there was a lot of fear Cody would be arrested for polygamy so the whole brood escaped to Las Vegas. They moved to Flagstaff after several years though the idea of going back to Utah lingered. When Christine left the plural family, she returned to Utah with her daughter. She wanted to be closer to her kids and family, plus polygamy laws were looser and to her, it was home. Cody gave her many reasons why it was a bad idea, but she is thriving. Even his former first wife, Mary is living there and running her B&B. Now, it appears that he and his last remaining wife have headed to Utah after everything in the family fell apart. But why? Where do they live? Sister Wives fans questioned where Cody and Robin Brown lived as they are never home. More so, they wanted to know why they were always seen shopping. Finally, many asked if Robin ever smiled. She seems to always be frowning and in a permanent state of disdain. The big question was if the couple planned on selling their home and settling elsewhere. This seemed to be home Cody liked to live which did not sit well with Robin as she disliked being transient. Unfortunately, his life completely blew up, he lost three wives and his kids don't talk to him. However, sister wives spoilers, why does Christine Brown keep bringing up Cody Brown? Sister wives spoilers reveal that fans are interested in why Kristen Brown continues to bring up Cody Brown even though she is married and moved on with her life. Christine left Cody three years ago and has been working on changing her life with her new husband, David Woolley. Even though she seems blissful and happier than ever, it turns out that she still likes to mention her ex-husband. Sister Wives Spoilers Why Christine Brings Up Cody Christine often talks about how it is laughable that she is no longer with Cody. She has also pointed out that she is happy with David. With all of the lows that she dealt with in the past, Christine has started to really embrace her new life. However, this doesn't mean that she has stopped bringing up Cody and now it looks as if she is doing more to support him. There was a recent video of Christine in her car and she made a confession. Her fans were shocked to see that she was bringing Cody back into her thoughts. This video, however, was mainly about nachos while she was at the gas station. She pointed out that she and Cody would be celebrating this special moment since they ate some delicious nachos on one of their first dates. Sister Wives Spoilers, The Nacho Video While Chrisine was talking to her fans about the gas station nachos, she had some interesting things to share. 
While Christine was talking about the nacho date with Cody, she pointed out that he was pretty disgusted by the fact that she wanted to eat gas station nachos. This is one of the moments that Cody admitted that he was not attracted to Christine, however, they ended up being married regardless. Christine felt that she just had to share these nacho moments with her fans. She told them it was the nachos anniversary then said it was nachos anymore. This was clearly a low blow at Cody because of how repulsed he was when they ate nachos together for the first time. It looks like Christine has decided to take in all of the memories, no matter good or bad, and share them with fans as she has turned around her mindset on her marriage to Cody. However, Sister Wives stars best patriotic photos. Sister Wives stars Mary Janelle and Christine celebrate Independence Day, emphasizing America and their freedom after leaving their polygamous marriage with Cody Brown. Janelle, Christine, and Mary showcase their strong bond with their children as well as their personal growth via their holiday celebrations and activities. The women of Sister Wives find happiness, security, and self-love through their holiday celebrations, highlighting their newfound self-sufficiency and contentment. Sister Wives stars Mary Brown, Janelle Brown, and Christine Brown are proud to be Americans. Even though the American legal system at times threatened the freedom of their polygamous family, the Brown women go all out to celebrate Independence Day on July 4th. Independence is particularly meaningful to Cody's exes Mary, Janelle, and Christine, as they have all flourished on their own in recent years. Mary, Janelle, and Christine were in a plural marriage with Cody Brown, they raised the family's 18 children together, along with Cody's fourth wife, Robin Brown. The sister wives' world was rocked when Christine ended her marriage and left the family in 2021. It was more shocking when Janelle and Mary announced the end of their spiritual unions with Cody within the next two years. As they move on and embrace life outside the world of polygamy, Mary, Janelle, and Christine have shared their journeys with viewers via social media. Janelle and her children visited Williamsburg. Janelle's bond with her children has remained strong through her marriage woes. On July 4, 2021, Janelle shared pictures of her children, Gabriel Brown, Garrison, Hunter, and Savannah. Her caption explained that they had spent the day in Williamsburg, Virginia, a significant location in American history. Janelle's children all wore patriotic red, white, and blue clothing for the holiday, with Gabriel even wearing American flag shorts. Independence Day has extra importance for Janelle's family because both Garrison and Hunter served in the United States Armed Forces. Janelle has always had a close bond with her children. She wrote that all of her children were with her on the trip except her son, sister wives Logan Brown. Although Janelle was still married to Cody at the time, he isn't in any of her pictures. Janelle used to appreciate the freedom that polygamy gave her considering Cody had to divide his time between his wives. As her marriage to Cody grew more challenging, Janelle continued to lean into her relationships with her children. She also embraced her love of travel. Christine's daughters shared a colorful snack. Christine put her talent for hosting on display. Following the July 4th holiday in 2022, Christine posted a photo of her daughters Michael T. Patron and Yisabel Brown enjoying meats and cheeses. Everything on the charcuterie board was red, white, and blue. The platter was arranged in the stars and stripes pattern of the American flag. Michael T. and Yisabel also dressed in the colors of the flag, right down to Yisabel's blue fingernails. Christine is known for her love of cooking. She hosted her own cooking show, Cooking with Just Christine, following her divorce, Christine was often considered the homemaker of the Brown family on Sister Wives between her knack for entertaining and her role in staying home to raise the children. With her culinary talent and her enthusiasm for holidays, it is no surprise that Christine was able to put together such an impressive and festive meal. Mary's patriotic shirt was paired with a heartfelt caption. She used her trademark wit to celebrate her freedom. In 2023, Mary celebrated Independence Day with a patriotic selfie. She wore a red, white, and blue shirt emblazoned with the words, Howdy, America. Mary added a caption reflecting on the meaning of Independence Day, writing whatever you're doing today, whoever you're spending it with, I hope you feel happy, safe, and loved. 
This photo marked Mary's first time celebrating the 4th of July since the end of her marriage to Cody. Her post was low-key, yet it emphasized the meaning of the holiday rather than the celebration. Mary has focused on her independence since setting out on her own away from the rest of the Brown family. Part of Mary's journey has been learning to love herself regardless of other people's opinions of her, and feeling happy, safe, and loved is her main ambition. Christine showed off her impressive decorations. Christine's enthusiasm shows through her holiday decor. Christine started her Independence Day celebrations early, posting a video in June 2024 that showed her decorating her home for the holiday nearly a month in advance. Ironically, she wore the same shirt Meredy had worn the previous year. Her decor included a stars and stripes blanket, a flag, and a red, white, and blue wreath. Since ending her marriage to Cody, Christine has been happier than ever. She is now married to David Woolley, and she has been open about how much she loves being in a monogamous relationship. David allows Christine to be unapologetically herself. This is a big change from her previous marriage, where Cody always expected his wives to follow his rules, even pertaining to holiday celebrations. The women of sister wives show what is important to them through their holiday celebrations. They value family, happiness, and security. Fortunately, these are all things they have retained through their divorces. As they celebrate their love for their country, Mary, Janelle, and Christine are also able to celebrate the independence they have found for themselves over the last few years. However, six reasons why Saab and Robin might not be the villain she is often portrayed as on Sister Wives are six reasons why Robin Brown might not be as bad as everyone's made her out to be. Let's take a step back and consider the wider picture before you join the Robin Brown as the villain bandwagon. Cody Brown's last standing wife is more complex than she first appears. Fans of Sister Wives, fasten your seatbelts because we're going to spill some juicy information. After reading this, you might think twice about what you thought you knew about Robin, even though her history in the Brown family has always been strange from her shifting roles in decision-making to her fragile relationships within the family. Still, let's examine her journey from a different pov. One, Robin has been beside Cody as the last wife standing. Robin is Cody's only remaining wife following his divorces from Mary Brown, Christine Brown, and Janelle Brown, and she has shown strong support for him as evidenced in a 2023 interview where she stated, I'm not going anywhere. We're sticking this out. Some people blame Robin for Cody's failed relationships with his other wives. However, others have defended her by saying Robin tried to keep things fair between all wives for a long time. Problems mainly started during the COVID-19 pandemic when Robin prioritized her children's safety, and Cody's unequal treatment of his wives caused most of the issues. Robin even encouraged Cody to improve his relationship with Mary. She told today that Cody's treatment of Mary felt like a deal-breaker. 2. Robin has fiercely protected stepchild Payton. At first, some thought Robin only cared about her own kids. However, it later became clear she cared for all the Brown children. Peyton Brown revealed that Robin told Cody about Mary's alleged mistreatment of him. He said, I will never hate Robin because she opened several eyes and because of that, I will never hate her, as per people. Robin has tried to break down barriers with the other wives and their children. She supported both her biological and stepchildren. Although Robin and Cody are now in a monogamous relationship, this wasn't their original plan. Robin chose polygamy believing it could create a close family when practiced with honesty and respect. 3. Robin and Cody's Strong Partnership Robin and Cody Brown have a strong relationship. They often agree on family matters, especially about their children. During COA-19, they made decisions together, even if it caused conflicts with other family members. They also work together on financial issues. Robin has always supported him, but on the other hand, Christine, Janelle, and Mary have been outspoken about their issues with Cody. Robin has frequently spoken respectfully of him. She has even drawn attention to his strengths as a husband and father. 4. Robin's Empathy and Compassion Robin, often called Sabin Robin because of how emotional she gets, is sometimes misunderstood. Her fans think this tendency to tear up isn't about being weak, 
It shows her deep empathy and compassion. This really stood out during Mary's issues with Cody after the catfishing incident. Viewers saw how much Robin cared as she listened and supported Mary. In the early years of her marriage to Cody, Robin also showed much concern for the children of Janelle, Mary, and Christine. As stated before, it was particularly clear when she took care of Peyton since she thought Mary wasn't treating him fairly. 5. Cool Robin, Hot-Headed Cody While Robin occasionally cries, she generally maintains her composure when faced with criticism. On the other hand, Cody frequently lets his emotions get the better of him. Even though Robin has previously made hurtful remarks regarding the weight of the other wives, she typically doesn't go low. She has even been charged with playing the victim, which supports the villainous image of her. However, Robin doesn't always resort to being rude while handling her own criticisms. This conduct may be interpreted as manipulative or it may be a reflection of Robin's tendency to resolve disputes amicably. 6. Robin's Influence and Commitment to Sister Wives Robin has played a big role in the Brown family dynamics, and some think she might have contributed to Cody's other marriages falling apart. Despite all the challenges and public scrutiny, Robin has stayed committed to the reality TV show Sister Wives, which showcases the family's struggles and conflicts. The show's success has brought financial benefits to them with their fame leading the family to opportunities like brand partnerships and big social media followings. Recently, Robin was seen filming for the upcoming 19th season of Sister Wives with Cody and her daughter Aurora Alice Brown, as per Screen Rant. However, Sister Wives, Orange Crush, Mary's Best Orange Outfits After Glam Body Transformation Mary Brown transforms her look after leaving her toxic marriage, focusing on self-discovery and weight loss. She uses her experiences to help others through her brand, Worthy Up, and shares reflections on Instagram. Mary's clothing choices reflect her inner peace and self-love, showcasing her natural beauty and inspiring others. Sister Wives star Mary Brown is looking her best in earthy orange tones. After shedding the baggage from her toxic marriage to ex-husband Cody Brown, the former polygamist has transformed her look with dramatic weight loss and a wardrobe upgrade. In recent years, Mary has embarked on a physical journey as well as one of self-discovery. She uses her experiences to help others find their value through her Worthy Up brand. Mary also shares reflections on Instagram to inspire her followers and give them a glimpse of her life now. Mary was Cody's first wife. They were married in 1990 when Mary was only 19. Cody went on to marry three other women, Janelle Brown, Christine Brown, and Robin Brown, to create the polygamous family that fascinated viewers of Sister Wives. Mary's marriage to Cody struggled due to many factors, including a cheating scandal, infertility, and conflict with her sister wives. Still, Mary remained loyal to Cody and the family, even as their romantic relationship became non-existent. Mary took her commitment to the family seriously, but in January 2023, she finally announced that her marriage to Cody was over. Mary Brown looks cute in an orange top with white stripes. She is most herself when she is laughing with her friends. Mary began to display her changing looks as her marriage to Cody was on its last legs. Her appearance became lighter as she started to look within and find herself. During a July 2022 edition of Fridays with Friends, Mary sported a hooded orange and white striped top. The vibrant color brightened up the screen as Mary laughed with her best friend, Jen Sullivan. With her blonde hair, Mary's shirt contributed to her laid-back summer vibe. She contrasted her outfit's bold color with heavy dark eyeshadow. As Mary and Cody grew more distanced, she spent a lot of time by herself. Cody rarely visited Mary and never stayed at her house. The families moved to separate homes in Flagstaff, Arizona, and the COVID-19 pandemic destroyed the plural family's unity. Mary and Cody's only child, Leon Brown, had moved away, leaving Mary alone most of the time. She learned to lean on her friends, especially Jen, as well as find solace within herself. During her marriage to Cody, Mary tended to gravitate toward oversized or dark clothing. This was a reflection of her insecurity and her desire to hide behind her clothes. Mary struggled to find her voice within the Brown family, 
Mary's orange striped top reflects the beginning of her transformation. Although her shirt had a hood, Mary was no longer hiding. She chose colors that made her stand out and appear strong. Even when Mary wears bold colors, she remains the focus, not her clothing. Mary Brown's coral top is so flattering. Her understated beauty shines through in earth tones. Mary looks stunning in earthy colors that complement her blonde hair. In May 2023, Mary shared a beautiful photo of herself staring into the camera wearing a coral zip-up jacket. Hello lovely viewers, welcome to my channel. I am Sabrina, hope your day is so well. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel.